All right, guys, today we're going to be working on number 116, Song for Maria. We're going to start off by clapping and counting. We have a pickup note in this song, so we're starting on beat four. If you look at the last measure of the song, there's only three beats, and we've taken that fourth beat and placed that at the beginning. And that's called a pickup note or a upbeat. All right, let's go ahead and start. One, two, three. Four, one, two, three. Four, one, two, three. Four, one, and two, and three. Four, one, two, three. Four, one and two and three four one two three four one and two and three four one two and three four and one two and three there's no four don't clap on four don't say four don't rest on four there's no four it already got used at the beginning now i'm gonna go ahead and say note names one two three a d D, F sharp, A, B, A, B, A, F sharp, D, E, E, G, A, A, G, F sharp, E, F sharp, A, D, D, F sharp, A, B, A, B, A, F sharp, A, G, F sharp, E, F sharp, D, F sharp, E, F sharp, E, D. Last thing I'm gonna do with everybody before I split onto individual instruments is rock it bow. Let's rock a bow these slurs. So make sure you have a nice, beautiful bow hold, bent thumb in the back as always, relaxed fingers. Everything should be nice and bent. Okay, nice and bent violins, violas, flat top of the hand, curled fingers, cellos and bass. The fingers are draped over. Still a nice bent thumb in the back. Still nice and flat on top. Nice, relaxed fingers. It's easier to do it when you have it pointing straight up and down. It's less weight over here. All right, let's rock a bow. One, it starts up bow because there's pickup note. So make sure you're going up first. One, two, three. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Up, down, up, down up 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 down okay make sure we're paying attention to all those slurs your arm is going in quarter notes the whole time it doesn't have to do anything else other than down up down up the whole time if you can keep that in mind and then get these fingers to be doing the opposite thing, doing eighth notes when they need to be doing eighth notes, you're going to be fine. All right, now we're going to switch into individual instruments, starting with violin. Violin. Let's go ahead and pizzicato this song, pizzicato. Starting on open A. One, two, three. Now we're going to pick up our bow and play it with our bow. Remember, if at any time this is going a little too fast, you have the option to slow down the speed of the video. Starts up bow. So you don't have to start at the very tip, but somewhere in the middle is a good place. One, two, three. That's how you play it on violin. I'm gonna switch over to viola now. All right, violas. We're going to go ahead and pizzicato first. 
make sure that we're up on the shoulder, not on the collarbone. Keep an eye out for fourth finger A's. One, two, three. time you can slow down the speed of the video so it's a better speed for you as you're learning start up bow you don't need to be at the very tip somewhere in the middle is fine uh one two three Go ahead and switch to cello now. All right, cello. I forgot to clean this up. Go pause real quick and I'll be right back. And we're back. I wanted to make sure I had a good tone, so I had to clean off some of the excess raws and I was on the string still. All right, so pitzing first, to pitz it first. Starting on open A, make sure we have that elbow up. We have nice open hand curled C and your thumb should be directly across from the middle finger. Okay, uh, one, two, three. time you can pause the video you can slow it down and go whatever speed you need to go to be able to learn the song correctly okay we're gonna start up bow we don't need to start all the way at the tip of our bow it doesn't take that long to go so somewhere in the middle of our bow is gonna be a good starting location for us do your best to make sure that you're keeping a nice straight bow I'm gonna do my best to do it no guarantees and make sure we have a nice relaxed bow hold as well uh, one, two, three. <laughs> on to bass now. Time for bass. Okay. Need to turn my stool just a little bit for holding this instrument. Okay. Bass players. sure that we have a nice relaxed bow hold bent thumb in the back as always make sure our elbows are up and away from our body this song does start up bow but we don't need to be all the way up tip for that first note we don't need that much time so somewhere in the middle is a good spot all right let's go ahead and play this i'm gonna do my best not to mess it up oh what am i doing we need a pit set first 
Let's pitch cow. Put your bow down. <clears throat> pitch cow first. Oh, one, two, three. one wrong note. I'm going to go ahead and pitch it one more time with you and then we'll pick up the bow. Uh, one, two, three. does start up bow. We don't need to start all the way out here though. Start somewhere in the middle. Uh, one, two, three. slower speed and then build back up to a faster speed with the slow down feature and I hope all that helps that's how you play on the bass bye